Let us pray. Complete within us, O Lord, we pray, the healing work of your mercy, and graciously perfect and sustain us, so that in all things we may please you, through Christ our Lord. Please be seated. Good morning, everyone. It's always a blessing to be with you on Sunday morning. I had a chance this morning to have some extra prayer time as Father McCona had Mass today, and I was just thinking about the blessings of God. You know, sometimes we come to God with a whole list of things we want God to do for us. But a beautiful way of praying is simply to say, thank you, Lord, for all of my blessings. Thank you for all the things you've done for me. Thank you so much for all you've done in my life. And so as I was praying this morning, I was also thanking God for you, the church family we have here at St. Martin de Porres. We are blessed. There's no doubt we are a blessed community in so many ways. And, and sometimes it's important to sit back and just say thank you to each other for how good we are to each other. Because God is good to us, we're called to be good to each other. When people ask me about the church opening up again, I, I never received that, that phrase. Throughout this terrible pandemic that happened back in March, our church never closed. The church can't close as long as we pray and do justice. Amen. As long as we do the work of Jesus Christ, the church is always open. Amen. And so we never close. We stopped having public mass. We sus suspended a lot of our ministries and programming. But the church is open because of you. You are the church. You are the Amen. people of God. Yeah. 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 And so in a very specific way, I want to thank all those who were so kind to the Barlow family on Friday and Saturday morning. The Barlow family is a great community, and they certainly deserve, Ms. Valida, a very beautiful home going. But a lot of hard work went into that. For those who opened the church up, for those who made sure things were prepared, a special word of thanks to our ushers, who spent hours here on Friday and also Saturday morning. Thank you so much for being kind. Thank you so much for what you do each day. And I know DeForio, who's with us today, he certainly feels the loss of his mom, but felt the great love that people had for her and have for this community. So thank you so much. There's a lot of hard work goes into that and making people feel welcome in this space. It was the biggest service we've had, the biggest celebration we've had since COVID. And everything went A++. Also, a thank you to those who are just so good in your ministries, helping out in so many ways, your generosity, your goodness to our church, our communication ministry, which keeps people knowledgeable and knowing what's going on in our church each day, each week, so important. And a word of thanks to those who volunteered and donated money and to take care of those in need after Mass today. We know so many people are hurting, aren't they? And a bag of food goes a long way. And many of us have everything we need plus. But to share our blessing is so important. So thank you to those who just simply are doing the work of justice. It doesn't matter if a person's Catholic or not, or the church or not. We're called to be Jesus to each other. And so thank you so much for your ministry you do. You don't need my permission, anyone's permission, to go out and do the work of Jesus Christ. So my heart is full of gratitude today. Give God a round of applause for what God has done for our church family. And uh, finally, before I take my seat, uh, hope. Word of hope. You know, it's a very tough time right now for a lot of people. But we come to church to receive uh, the word, to receive the Eucharist, and receive hope. And so I hope you have that feeling today in your heart. If you leave here today, no matter how difficult things may be, Jesus Christ woke you up this morning. And he's with you each and every day in your life. And so walk in that way of Jesus Christ each and every day, and have a great week. God bless you. Please stand. The Lord be with you. May Almighty God bless you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Mass is ended. Go forth, glorifying the Lord by your life. Thanks be to God.